Hello, this is David. Um, today, this video, we are going to bring you a way uh, how to troubleshoot your K-Map drawing. So this means um, we are not going to teach you from scratch how to draw the map. Instead, um, when you and some of the mistakes being made on your K-Map, uh, you should refer to this video and see if we have included your mistakes in here. Okay, the first mistakes I made um, is the sequence of the number on headings. So you think um, on the first of your headings put on 00, zero yeah is obvious, and then followed by 01, and then it would be 10, right? All right, this is wrong. Um, take a look on the right hand side. Uh, zero, 01 should follow by 11 and then 10. Uh, I'm not sure what's the reasons of doing this in this way, um, but follow it. Okay, second, you should not put zero in your box. Okay, third point. Um, your loop should be formed in a rectangular shape and it could not be placed in a diagonal groupings. Okay, follow the one on right hand side, uh, do it in horizontal or vertical way. And uh, many people got this wrong as well. Um, let's say on the right hand side, People sometimes get this example done by including three cells in a box. You can't do it. In this case, you can only include, let's say, um, two cells in a box and the second cells, you have one cell in a box. Okay. Um, let's say like uh, left one, we are doing it right because they are doing it in a group of two and in a group of four, which is a power of two. Additionally, um, if your cell is on the edge of the box, you can actually uh, connect them like the figure shown in right hand side. Um, this one shows that because if you flip the paper like as is shown, um, these boxes can actually be connected. So um, let's say on the top left box and top right box, they are connected. The right, top right and bottom right, they are connected as well. So you can count them in the same boxes. Okay, and you can read this summary and do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.